Hello everyone. Today, we're exploring the medication known as lenalidomide, more commonly referred to by its brand name, Rivlimid. As with our previous discussions, this information is purely for educational purposes. Always consult with a medical professional for health-related concerns or questions. Description Lenalidomide, widely recognized by its brand name Rivlimid, is an oral capsule primarily categorized as an immunomodulatory drug. Its main function is to stimulate the immune system to attack and destroy cancerous cells, slowing or stopping their growth. Rivlimid has received approval from the FDA to treat multiple myeloma, a type of blood cancer, in combination with dexamethasone, another medication. Furthermore, it is prescribed for individuals with anemia caused by myelodysplastic syndromes, MDS, and for patients with mantle cell lymphoma, a type of non-Hodgkin lymphoma, especially if they have received at least one other treatment. Warnings Rivlimid comes with severe birth defects warnings. Women who are pregnant or may become pregnant should avoid this medication as it can harm the unborn baby. Hence, females of reproductive age are required to undergo pregnancy testing and utilize two forms of contraception. Men receiving Rivlimid should also use a condom to prevent causing a pregnancy. Moreover, this medication can also lower blood cells, increasing susceptibility to infections, delayed healing, and bleeding. Blood tests are essential to monitor these effects. Before taking this medicine, there are various factors to consider before starting Rivlimid. Patients should inform their healthcare provider if they are allergic to the drug or any of its ingredients. Informing the healthcare provider about any liver or kidney disease, lactose intolerance, or if you've ever had a blood clot or a stroke is essential. It's also crucial to let your doctor know if you're pregnant, planning a pregnancy, or breastfeeding. One should not take Rivlimid if they are pregnant, can become pregnant, or if they have advanced liver disease. Discuss any other serious health conditions with your doctor to determine if Rivlimid is right for you. Side Effects Like all medications, Rivlimid may lead to side effects. Some common ones include diarrhea, rash, nausea, constipation, and fatigue. More serious side effects include blood clots, stroke, liver problems, and severe allergic reactions. Regular monitoring and prompt reporting of any unusual symptoms to your doctor are crucial. Interactions Rivlimid can interact with other medications. Ensure you inform your doctor about all medications, vitamins, or herbal products you're currently using. Some drugs might need to be adjusted or monitored closely when used concurrently with Rivlimid. Dosage Dosage is a crucial factor in ensuring the drug's effectiveness. Adherence to the healthcare provider's recommended dosage is essential. The exact dose of Rivlimid varies based on the medical condition, response to treatment, and other factors. Regular monitoring, including blood tests, can help ensure safety and efficacy. Always follow your healthcare provider's guidance and never change your dosage without consulting them. Avoid. Given the potential for severe birth defects, women of reproductive age should strictly follow contraceptive guidelines. It's also crucial to adhere to frequent pregnancy testing as directed. Both men and women are advised to avoid donating blood or sperm during treatment and for a specified time after discontinuation of the drug. FAQ A common question regarding Rivlimid pertains to its risk of causing tumors. While it's primarily used for cancer treatment, there is a slight risk of developing new cancers, secondary malignancies, during treatment. Always discuss risks and benefits with your healthcare provider to make informed decisions. Closing In conclusion, this gives an overview of Rivlimid or lenalidomide. Remember, this information is educational and should never replace professional medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare provider regarding any concerns or queries. Thank you for joining us today.